New effort to protect pedestrians on Bush Boulevard. This is all happening right here, Nebraska to 50th Street. ABC Action News reporter Lauren Rosella is driving Tampa Bay forward this morning. She's live with what you can expect to see out there today. Good morning, Lauren. Good morning, Dia. So there will be uh, Florida Department of Transportation officials out here at uh, 56th and Bush Boulevard uh, starting in just a couple of hours. And what we're excited to tell you about is that they're going to be handing out uh, a lot of free safety gear. This includes uh, free helmets. Uh, they're also handing out free bike lights. Uh, they'll also be handing out free reflective gear, including backpacks and armbands. But overall, take a look at this map. There isn't a bigger safety effort out here on Bush Boulevard. Boulevard to try and stop those deadly crashes. They are hoping to install new crosswalk beacons in these four intersections along Bush Boulevard. And the big difference here from a regular crosswalk is that there will actually be a red light forcing cars to stop for pedestrians and bikers. Now, if you'd like to end up getting some of those free items that I just mentioned or just support FDOT's new safety effort, you can stop by 56th Street and Bush Boulevard this morning from 7 to 11 a.m. And back out here live coming up ahead in our next half hour. It is not just Bush Boulevard that's had a series of safety issues. We are uncovering uh, more of what we found that's been trouble spots along 56th Street. Again, that's coming up again at 530. Reporting live this morning in Hillsborough County, Lauren Rosella, ABC Action News.